All right, so this game is called The Librarian. Something is wrong in the library. Uh, let's go read the text here. So, uh, something's wrong in the library. Liz's temple and safe place is threatened by the unknown, by ghosts from her own darkest dreams. She must go investigate. She's a librarian after all. Then you have some reviews here by Rocker the Shotgun, PC Gamer, and The Verge. Uh, after the success of Midnight Scenes, this is the new short game by Octavio Navarro, creative Pixel Hue, and the artist on games like Thimbleweed Park and Photographs. I heard Thimbleweed Park. Wait, let me see. What is Photographs? I feel like I heard of this game before. I don't know if I heard of this game or if I heard of Thimbleweed Park before. I don't remember which one I heard of. I might be wrong, but I feel like... But I felt like I heard of this, and there's like a little trailer here, but I'm not, I'm, I'm not going to play I feel like I heard of this before. Maybe. I don't know. I'm not sure. I don't know why. It, it, it's kind of just like one of those things of like a name that you think you heard of, but you didn't really hear of it. I don't know. I, I guess that's how it feels like. The Librarian is a very personal game whose production started a long time ago, much before Midnight Scene, but was shelved for years. Now it's finally finished and ready for you to play. Subscribe to our mailing list to keep updated on the game release. The game is completely free, but if you enjoy it and would like to help the creation of future titles, please consider buying a copy. Uh, for the price of your choice or support my work on patreon also don't forget to uh, rate the game it helps me a lot and that's what we'll do we all, I, I always like to rate the games after it's always really cool um i i, I don't do it on stream because it's kind of weird <laughs> it's, it's just kind of weird stuff that you do okay so let's just launch the librarian let's do it right now shall we be kind of fun have some fun with that and then yeah uh 1920 by 1080 uh make sure this time it's not windowed because i remember last time i had a game i don't remember what it was i think it was Good morning, I think I had windowed by accident and I didn't realize it. So yeah, so let's just have it 1900 by 1080. Uh, not windowed this time around because I remember uh, it was automatically windowed on good morning and I didn't realize that. So the game was like kind of weird. Yeah. So maybe with Unity, yada yada yada. Uh, Unity configuration. Unity. Oh, that's loud. showed all of the good stuff but we'll see okay so here's the controls um it, 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 it is a point and click type of game i thought it was like wasd but like but like but like, we, but like we, we click on like many things in the game um what just happened was that like was that like my character was like sleeping in bed and there was like a weird like snowstorm kind of right but then there's a candle i can click on the candle okay i can light up the room an agent uh some like thimbleweed that looks like thimbleweed I, look thimbleweed i think an agent what is this guy who are you about a note Something is wrong in the library. Well, thank you, Mr. Owl. And he transformed to a key. All right, cool. So I, I'm just looking around to see if there's anything I can click around here at the moment, except this library key. So we now have a library key and a book. I can, can I just click the book? How do I read said book? Okay, so I'm holding the book right now. Okay, cool. So I'm holding the book, so I gotta find a place on where to stash the book. Can I put it in here? In the cabinet, maybe? No, I can't put it in here. Okay, so let's just keep walking around. Let's just, let's just it's a nice house, dude. It's, it's a nice little cabin in the middle of uh, in the middle of a nice little um, snowy valley. A, a cabin would a cabin would, would be kind of nice to live in, probably. I, I I never had a cabin, but you know, maybe one day. <laughs> okay, cool. So there's like a nice little fireplace, uh, a wine, a wine decanter. I don't I have no idea what that is actually. I can go upstairs if I need to. Uh, what is a wine decanter? Enchanter. Okay, cool. Let's see, anything here to look at? Oh, wait, a wardrobe? What is this wardrobe? What do you have, my friend? Librarian uniform? Okay. And a spirit dagger? Why do I need a spirit dagger for? Am I going to be fighting things? Okay, so there's some options here. 
Just simple music stuff. I can't take away the immersion. I'm sorry if you're immersed in the game. Oh, my character's getting dressed up. Nice. We're getting a little bit different. I like it. I like it. Pretty good stuff. There's nothing back here. Good job, girl. I don't know what your name is, but you know, you have a name. Um, okay, so, to, so the library is not inside the cabinet. They should go outside. Oh, there. Oh, he just wanted to hold on. Kill him! Alright, so he won't let me pass. There's a puddle here. I can't click the puddle. And yeah, he won't let me pass. Okay, so there are a couple ways that- Okay, wait- Oh! Ooh, yeah, put this in the puddle. There you go. Come on. Come on. What, what, what was it? Oh yeah, he's drunk. <laughs> He's drunk. Can I kill him? Oh, I can't kill him. Oh, I want to kill him. Kill him. Okay, so yeah, if, if I click the puddle, like, she, she kind of just shrugs me off. So I guess, like, she, she doesn't really, like, know, like, what to do. Okay, so I guess we'll go to, towards the main street. So let's see what's in the main street. A bunch of, like, town, a bunch of, like, towns and houses and stuff like that. So my character kind of lives, like, far off the main street area. You know, like, my character's kind of like a, a loner, you know? Uh, kind of like everybody else, like watching this video. Yeah, uh, like it's, it's like it's like you guys are all loners and stuff like that. I, I love how like every time when I stop, like the character like has like these like these like weird like white like um like like white like squares like like coming out of her like and she's like surprised something like, like <gasps> I don't know. <laughs> so I guess we, we keep, I know there's a, I know there's a library door like this way, but I do want to keep looking. There's a broken window right here. Oh wait. Oh, okay, I can't go back. No, I wanted to go through the library door. Oh my god, dude. I wanted to keep looking. I didn't want to go here. Oh my god, dude. I, 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 like, I, like, I like exploring, dude. If, if I don't get to explore, it's just just it's kind of weird. It's, it's, so, it's like I'm, I'm like holding to like move, but like I have to like keep clicking, which I don't really like to do that. Like I don't like clicking all the time, but it's kind of whatever. It's, the game is like kind of semi 3D. As you guys can see, like when I'm clicking like the back area here, I click like the front and the back area. It's kind of nice. So let's go here. What is around this area? There's like this like weird door. Am I stuck here though? I think I'm soft locked. I think I'm kind of semi soft locked here actually. Uh, cause I can't go through the window again. Yeah, no, I'm kind of semi soft locked. Let me see. What do I do here actually? The book. Let me see a book here. Is there like a place I could like put like a book maybe at? Cause like, cause like, there's like a candle right here. I still have the key. I, I think I soft locked myself. I think I did. Yeah, I nice. Okay, great. <laughs> I soft locked myself. Wait, no. Wait. Ooh. Ooh, wait, right here. This one. Ooh. Uh, I was literally just felt like. Um, okay, here we go. My book. Right here. Wait, what? Uh, here we go. Right there. There you go. I thought I almost soft locked myself for a little bit. For a second, I was like, oh my god, I soft locked myself. I'm so done. I was, I was literally about to quit the game and then come back to it, dude. I was literally about to, okay, a strange machine. What is this about? Okay, so there's like a broken handle. Um, can I put like a spirit dagger in there? Nope. So I need to find a place for a handle. No, I, I think I am soft locked though, still. Yeah, no, I think I am. Maybe I can use like a spirit dagger on this thing, maybe? A tree branch right here. There you go. Okay, there we go. So I use like the tree branch on the strange machine. I don't know why I, 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 keep, I keep thinking I'm soft luck, dude. I give up too damn easy. I'm telling you, I give up too damn easy. A lot of stuff is going on. Let's, let's see what's happening. Let's see what's happening upstairs. Let's, let's go upstairs, see what's happening. Looks pretty cool though. Looks pretty chill-ish. You know, it doesn't look that bad. You know, it doesn't look like it's trying to kill me at all so far, as you can tell. A button that says the O. <gasps> Uh, another button that shows like a chair. Another button that shows like a in, in a triangle. A V. Okay. Uh, and, and then an upstairs area. I can also go upstairs again. And then there's a door lock. I think it'll probably be smart for me to use the key. Or I can go upstairs here again. I don't think I should have done that. Oh, a student. Okay, so let me go back downstairs. Let's figure out what's down. Okay, so, so let's do what's downstairs first. Because I'm trying to... Yeah, okay, so here we go. So, so let me see. So there's a door lock right here. What is this? The former librarian? Is he dead? 
hard lens. Yoink, I'll take that for myself, kind sir. I know you're dead, but I'm going to have to use this as I see fit. There's a library key, which I can use on the door lock. Okay, it broke the key. Nice. So now I have a broken key. I think that's supposed to happen, but I, I, I didn't want to lose my key, though. Can I just click the button? Okay, doom. And this one's gonna be like the, and then, and, then this one, and then this one's gonna be like very high pitch, right? That was probably wrong. Uh, I think so. I, I I think that was the wrong answer. Um, so in, instead of uh, doing doing what we're doing, I guess we'll keep going towards the library student. We'll see what the library student has to say, because I think that guy would would probably be the most interesting character at the moment let me just make sure everything's going good so far everything's going good everything's showing good everything's looking good everything's looking really nice okay here we go oh my god my mental app crashed my phone again so let's see what the student has to say oh he's dead oh uh and then next finger middle finger ring finger pinky cool oh wait so what's the order i should go in then okay let me see then What's the order I should go on? Index finger. So V, V, chair, uh, surprise face. <laughs> v, chair, surprise face. That's what I say. V, chair, surprise face. And then the last one, um, what I forgot what it was. So yeah, so let's see the, so let's see the V. V, chair, surprise face. And then the triangle. What is the triangle? Triangle, triangle, triangle. Let's see. What are we doing? I show a little shake, rumble tumble. Broken statue. So it seems like I drop out I drop a ball. Whoa. I have a spirit dagger! Haha, -ha, you sucker! A crowded soul. Crowded soul. I have a broken key. I have a red lens. I have a spirit dagger. I'm just kidding. Die. Well, I guess I won't be needing that anymore then, I guess so. Guess I won't be needing that anymore. An iron spear. Uh, an, uh, an iron spear. It's kind of cool. Oh, I think I, I. Oh, wait. I think I was supposed to go through the window then. Because. Yeah, I think I was supposed to. Yeah, I was, I was supposed to go through the window. I'm so stupid. Because I remember I used the key on the library door. And I'm pretty sure like what would happen if that if I would use a key in the library, then that means that probably like the key would have broken and I'd have to have found another entrance. Okay, what is this? Is there anything over here that I should probably look for except except this right here? Because it, it, it seems like that's about it though. Alright, cool. A nice little chair that's tumbled over. Uh, a door with a number three on it, it seems like. Let's keep going. Let's see what's over here. A little like area should I oh wait oh round socket right here I think I should put the red lens in here right nope uh the iron sphere I I I want to see okay um, what is this our darkest times any reading no reading oh and I died nope I think I'm dead this looks weird this looks weird am I dead or not I remember the last thing I did was I put the iron spear into the socket and then I just fainted. I don't know if I'm dead. I might be dead. Is the student still here? Yes, he is. Okay, so yeah, I am dead. I, mean, I think I'm dead because I, I can't interact with him no more. I, I can go downstairs again. I, I think that would be the best case here. To go downstairs. Alright, let's go downstairs. The former librarian. Okay, he's still the same way as he always was. Still the same dude. Okay, candle. Oh, red lens. Oh, okay. So like, okay, so like when I click this, it kind of like, sh uh, like, like noted like, like the red lens as you guys can see. I think it did, right? I thought it did. I feel like I feel like it told me to have done that. Oh, okay. What is this? A 
a chalice of some sort. It's like a chalice of some sort. I don't know like whether like, I don't know like how should I interact with this somehow. Maybe it's something to do with later. So I think maybe if I look for like another candle and I do the same thing, maybe I can like create all the candles to like light up with each other. Maybe it's an idea. It's an interesting idea. I think so. Let's go here. Maybe yeah, it, yeah. Like see, like there's like another candle here, and I can use like the red lens on the candle too to activate some kind of like lighting. Chalice, uh, a sideways S, a sideways S. Okay, that's, that's kind of cool. It's, it's nothing too crazy, I guess, though. Because I'm trying to like figure out like, like, like where's the whole idea of this exactly? Like, oh, well, the broken window's still there, but it looks a little bit different though. It's kind of cool. The little tree branch, uh, that area is still the same. Okay, so let's go back upstairs then. There might be one more candle up on the last floor, maybe. That might help me complete this project that I'm currently in and exhibiting. Uh, I, I, I just said the word exhibiting. I don't even know what that word. Well, I do know what it means, but I don't think I use it right. Hmm. I don't think I use it right because, like, it, it's like a, I, I think you're supposed to use the word exhibiting as like an as like an exhibitionist kind of, right? You know, as like a sexy lady dancing up on a stripper pole. Which I kind of want to see that right now. I'm just joking. I don't. Know. Okay. Point is, <laughs> no more talking about sexy ladies dancing on stripper poles. Okay. Uh, so let's go back to this. Let's go do the last candle that we have to do here. All right, here we go. Right here, here's the last candle, and I think I already lit. I, I think I already lit everything else up. Right here, and then the lasso, which is kind of cool. Okay, so I'm thinking the order. I'm thinking I might have to do order, right? So it's like if I go like here, yeah. If I go like here, I might have to do like order or something like that. Okay, I think the S was first. Oh, okay, I get it, I get it, I get it, okay. S, and then this. That is not right. Um, crap. Okay, that's not right either. I don't know what you want me to do. Oh no, dude. Okay, so that's number four. Yeah, you see that's number four. So let's go back. I don't remember the order too much. I don't remember the order. I, th I thought I, I thought I did. See, that's number three. No, I can't see a number there, though. That's the issue. I can't see like a number here. But this has to be like number three then. Okay. So I don't have to go all the way back down now that I know this. I can do like this, number four, three. Then all I just have to do is just do this one. See, it's not that order, so it has to be this order. Here we go. Kind of just using order of elimination right there, so I kind of just solve my way through. The red lens is shining again. I don't know what it wants. I wonder if I could have used the red lens on the um, on the buttons right here, if that would have done anything important to me. I don't know if it would have. Who knows? Who would have known? Let's see. What is this area? It, it, it kind of looks like a, a Castlevania up close thing. I played Castlevania for a little bit. It's kind of cool. It's a very hard game though. I'm going to play it eventually. When I get like a capture card for like the 360 and all that stuff. But lots, of, lots of games. Lots of games. Lots of games for sure. Um, there's a glass door over here. I just want to probably check that out first of all. Can't actually go through it yet. Can I smash the key on it? Okay. No. Sadly, we don't do that here. Sadly, sadly, we don't smash keys on doors. There's a toucan. So he won't let me take the key. There has to be a way to do this then. I probably must have missed something that I don't really understand here. Am I missing anything? I'm kind of like looking through like the level, kind of like checking it out. Maybe I missed something. Oh, oh, his screech broke. His screech broke the. The glass door, okay. What is this? What are you, a, a bug? A, 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 a trapped baby crow. His baby! He lost his baby! Oh my god, he lost his baby, dude. No wonder why he's so angry. I would be angry too. What the hell? I lost. Dude, his baby crow got trapped inside that area. That's so sad. Oh no. 
There you go, little buddy. Take it now. You're free to. Oh my god, he lost his baby. That's so sad. Library key. I think this was actually the, the real library key. Because the broken key and then there's the main door key. So now I think I can finally exit the library here. Into the outside world again. But this time I'm actually dead, right? Remember that. I'm still dead. I put the key. I think I'm dead. Am I still dead? I, I don't know if I'm dead or not. You know, I, I'm kind of just using the game's um, imagery to kind of, you know, gather my own idea here and kind of figure out, like, what the hell's going on because I don't know what the fuck is going on right now. Oh, wait. Okay. Those dead. I'm not dead no more. I don't know. There's a lot of skeletons around the place. If you notice that. I, I, I haven't seen one live human. Just skeletons everywhere. Skeletons on the tree, skeletons uh, in like the back flight panels. What's going on here? Lights out. The Librarian, a short game by Octavia, Octavia ne ne Nevero. That was kind of nice. That's kind of cool. I like the idea. There's programming, sound effects, fix a font, and made with Unity. Adventure creator. Yeah, it's kind of cool. Uh, next game. Thank you for playing streamers and viewers for playing such watching. More coming soon. And thank you guys for watching also. Um, and no, and as I say, you're welcome, but thank you. Um, cool. So this is a nice little game. Um, uh, it was nice and nice. It was nice and small. I think the whole point was to help the crow, because I think that was the whole point about the game, was that the crow was in distress, I think. I'm kind of I'm confused on like the main point of the game, really. Like, I remember I was dead, and then I wasn't dead. So I, I don't really understand like the whole point of why I died in the first place. I could have lost of that, so I don't know if there, if there was like a point in, in the story to find out, maybe. I don't know, dude. <laughs> Thank you guys and gals for enjoying this gameplay video. If you guys would like to see more or you enjoyed it, please hit the like button, ring the bell, and tell your friends for more content. If you guys and gals would like to see more content just like this or other things I have made, check out the description for all the links uh, I have on games, music, and art. And I'd like to see you guys and gals later. Bye!